Uh, hey guys, what's up? It's James YDL. Uh, today I'm going to be showing you how to get 2K quality on your videos on YouTube using Sony Vegas Pro. Uh, you can use any, any Sony Vegas Pro, but I'm going to be using Sony Vegas Pro 12. So uh, as you can see, I have my clip on my timeline. Uh, you should have your clip already edited, uh, so you're ready to render. Uh, so what you want to do is you want to select your bit where you want to render by clicking and dragging across the top. Then you want to go to the render button render as you then want to go to main concept AVC slash AAC MP4 so just press the little arrow next to that uh, you can then choose any of these but I'm going to go down to internet HD 1080p and then click customize template you'll then want to go to the frame size and you want to change this to custom frame rate right in the width you want to put 2550 and in the height, you want to put 1,440. Yeah, you want to uncheck allow source to adjust frame rate. Uh, you want to change the frame rate to whatever your capture source is. So just change it to exactly the same as what your capture source is. So my capture source records at 29.97 frames per second. If it records at 60 frames per second, you can change it to 60 by typing in 60. But I'm going to keep mine at 29.97 frames per second you then want to go to number of restaurant frames I put four and then go down to variable variable bit rate you're then wanting to put the max bit rate to 50 million and then the average bit rate to 28 million uh, the only reason you want to do this is because when you upload it on YouTube you want the bit rate to be as high as possible uh, so it doesn't lose any quality. So in 2K resolution, it will look uh, as good as possible. So the higher the bit rate, the better the quality will be. But remember, the higher the bit rate you put, the higher render times you're going to have. So at the moment, I just leave it at 50 million and then average at 28 million. Number of slices, I leave that on one. I don't really see a difference. Uh, encode method. Uh, you can either render using CPU or if you have a GPU or a graphics card available, you can render with any of these. You can check you have a graphics card uh, like enabled in for render by going to system and then check GPU. And then it says that CUDA is available. So that's basically my graphics card is available. So I could render with CUDA if I wanted to, but I'm not going to. I'm going to render with CPU only. Uh, you can then change the audio to whatever you want, but I'm going to leave it on the default. Then you go to the project tab, and then video rendering quality, put the best, and then leave these two on the normal one, so default and use and use project settings. Then click OK, and then you'll be ready to render, so then press browse, and I'm going to call this 2K test, and then click save, and then render. And as you can see, if you are rendering right, the project will be rendering 2,550 times 1,440. And it's rendering at 29.97 frames per second. So yeah, if this tutorial helps you guys in any way, uh, please leave a like and a comment and subscribe for more Sony Vegas video tutorials. And thanks for watching.